Welcome back, Good Day Kansas continues from Bueller where we are continuing to share a little bit about behind the scenes with Idea Tech in our Internet Freedom for All series and we welcome back to the show co-founder and chief innovation officer, this is Daniel Friesen. Thank you so much for joining us again. Thank you, Jillian. Of course. So as we learn a little bit more about Idea Tech, we keep hearing fiber. That's what you're based off of. We want to learn a little bit more about it. So kind of why fiber shares, share with us a little bit about that. Mm -hmm. So fiber internet or fiber optics is a technology that uses light waves to basically send internet information from place to place mm -hmm. and the reason it's significantly better is is mainly because of its scalability and its capacity so when we deploy fiber into a community it's a technology that is by far the fastest technology it's you know, a hundred times faster than cable, thousand times faster than DSL or satellite. And so with that technology, and that's just the, the speed it can do today, we can actually um, deploy that speed today and then it has uh, a capability to be upgraded over time. And mm -hmm. so we feel like the technology that exists in fiber optic could benefit communities for decades to come. Mm -hmm. and so it's kind of a put it in once and you're done technology. Okay. And it's a lot uh, better technology than some of the um, alternative products, whether it's cable or wireless, where that technology requires constant upgrading. And so those services are always a little bit behind fiber. Mm -hmm. And so we feel like we have a great advantage in something that uh, communities and Residents, residents, and customers uh, alike really uh, will will see value in, sure. and and a technology that's um, going to last and be scalable for a long time in the future. Yeah, and you have a unique perspective, being a Kansan, sure. growing up in two types of communities. But mm -hmm. why, in your opinion, why should Kansans want fiber so bad? Kansas is kind of at the bottom end of. Um, service deployment levels today and so we're, we're kind of at the, the bottom fifth of depending on which information you look at mm -hmm. from a, uh, a speed perspective mm -hmm. and so Kansans and they know this already mm -hmm. uh, we're behind in, in technology especially in rural areas of the state mm -hmm. but even in more urban areas there's a lot of opportunity for uh, a little bit more competition and choice mm -hmm. in uh, broadband deployment, and so uh, that's part of our mission to, uh, you know, get people internet freedom and deliver a faster service for them, and and give them a choice that's substantially better than anything they have today. So, how can someone at home receive more information about Idea Tech or learn if you're headed their direction soon? Yeah, you bet. So, they can go to our website, ideatech.com, and click on Check Availability for more information. We certainly appreciate your time, Daniel. Thank you. Thank you. Of course, stick around. We do have more right after this.